Hi, I'm Andrea Anthony, and you're watching Eat, Drink, and Bake with Andrea. This is my olive oil of choice today, and it's a very big part of our recipe. Today, I have some great recipes for you. We're gonna throw this in a 400 degree oven for about 30 minutes until it's nice, golden, and caramelized. Now we're ready for our onions. And again, I'm using my tongs just to kind of toss them around the mixture. The nice thing about this dish is it's very simple. Time to check on our onions. They've been cooking for a while. One thing we look for is the edges are starting to turn white, so we know it's cooking nicely. I like to add some of the rough ingredients first. Now, if you're not a walnut lover, you can use pecans. Ginger pear crisp. Our spices. We're gonna have a little pepper, a little bit of salt. Now we're gonna add our chicken broth. Simmer for about another five or 10 minutes and then we're ready to go. So here's our spinach, and we're gonna finish it off with some freshly grated Parmesan cheese. By the way, I'm using uh, Himalayan salt, pink salt. They're all salted. We've pounded them out a little bit so they're nice and thin. And our tomatoes. And we have our tomatoes and stock and wine, and it all came together to make this great sauce. a very, very special sauce I'm using today. It's called Mama Lombardi's tomato sauce, and it's actually the only sauce I would use in a recipe. So, Lauren is going to be supervising this recipe over at the stove, much like her grandmother does and did for many years. Yes. Add our cream. Just gonna take a knife. Okay, the seeds will water down our recipe. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut them in half. You're literally gonna squeeze them. Fall out of the biscotti. They don't mix in the dough as well. So that's a little tip on that. And we have our sliced almonds over here. So our dough is finished, and we're gonna scrape it off the bowl here. Now, you want about 14 inches. So now for the main course, and that's our veggie burgers. You want them to be nice and crisp on the outside, tender on the inside. So it's a great dish, it's versatile, whether you're a vegan, a vegetarian. Okay, so you can see that this is more creamy. Thank you for watching Eat, Drink, and Bake with Andrea.